Okay then, does anyone recognize this brand? Well, believe it or not, this is actually Yeston. Yes, the graphics card Yeston. Now, if I if that looks what I think it looks like, it says Zeus XT. I'm not 100% sure, but that looks like Zeus XT. So this is a 360mm AIO from them. Now, I did reach out to them and I thought, right, okay, let's have a take a little look-see at an AIO from a graphics card brand. So, pwah! Ooh! Oh! Oh! oh. Wow, look at that! Now, I like the, the fans already piquing my interest because look they got oh they got yellow accents oh that's so cool i like that now yeah it is yes done so yes but uh obviously it doesn't say yes on the brand but yes done does own this brand so just so you know it does support lj 1700 1200 um am4 and am5 it will because they're back backwards, backwards compatible it does come with uh Brackets were here, so it comes with the uh, Intel bracket. Then it comes with these, and for the AMD, which are basically like the Acer Tech ones, they just clip on. And then, but I like that; that's good. So yeah, it comes with all that, like thermal paste and such. So yeah, yeah, no documentation, unfortunately. So, but I'm assuming this is just going to be very straightforward to install. So now, let's take a look at this AIO, because for just from the look of it, it looks nice. So, big copper base. Oh, and yes, it has a screen. Now, I'm going to take this off, because I really want to look at this. Oh, wow. So it's standard ARGB. It's got a four, what the, oh, that's a USB 2, it is, for the screen. I wish it was... PWM4, but that's fine. So this is the screen. Ooh, does this come off? No, so you can't really remove it. Oh well. But that looks very, very cool. So it's a little display, something I've never actually looked at. I haven't looked at a AIO except for the MSI one, but I didn't get to keep that one. This one I did. So this one, I do like the display, big base plate. Now, let's have a look at these, the radiator and fans. Good God, that's quite heavy. Right, Ooh. Right, let's get this moved. Right, this packaging up here. Let's take a look at these fans. Okay, so you saw that with the display. Ooh, look at that. Oh, I'm loving the aesthetics. Oh, that is cool. Wait, oh, these are all, oh, they're all connected to one. Awesome. So these are like clip-ons, just like Lee and Lee. Oh, this looks really nice. I do like it. Now, the, obviously, it's got a bit of brand in there, but it's the fans. These are cool. Oh, I can't wait to install this. So it does come off like this by here. So it's a proprietary cable. Yeah, proprietary. So at least you wouldn't have to worry. I know that Yeston have got a lot of different AIOs they've got um, a different version to this but this is their most premium because it comes with the screen so but now the blades they are like this does look awfully lot awfully a lot like a thermal right or a not to a fan looks very similar to them but I do like it big bearing very smooth bearing I like the RGB and I love the uh, yellow. I believe it's yellow, so I'm colorblind, so I don't know if it's actually yellow. But I'm liking the aesthetics. Oh, so it does just come off then. Oh, well, that's good. At least if you don't like that yellow or green aesthetic, at least you can take that out. Now, I really do like this. And I'm going to be sticking this on my test bench because I'm really, really looking forward to taking a look at this. So, yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Look, this is just a quick look for you guys to see it. Now, I will be making a full uh, review of it, so make sure you subscribe for that. First of all, I do like the overall look, the design, the fans. They look very, very nice. I do like the accents, and I like the fact that they clip together by the looks of it. Wait. 
Yes, they do. They do clip together. Yes, they do. So, similar to what Lee and Lee do, but not exactly the same, so it's good. But, yeah. So, yeah, look. I reached out to them. I looked on their website. I saw that they had AIOs. I have asked them previously about a graphs card, but, of course, my following isn't as big, so they do have requirements for that. But... I thought, right, an AIO, that's definitely something that we could collaborate with. I do like the anime style. I'm not overly fond of the pinks and the purples and stuff, but, but you know, that's just one of them things. So I will be doing a full review of this, and I hope you guys like the video. I like the aesthetics. I like the way the fans are built. I like that it's got an LCD screen because that is something I haven't looked at except for ones from MSI. And that's pretty much it, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. This is Richard for Tech. I hope you guys have a fantastic week and weekend ahead of you. Good. Bye.